So let's meet the software first. This is how to set up your ARM Cortex project. In order to get started, you'll need to download and install this software. Kyle Tools is a great editor that I use on my projects. The reference manual is excellent for navigating around the microcontroller. And the data sheet, well, it's great when you don't want to blow things up. First you gotta start by opening Microvision and selecting the Projects tab up at the top and selecting New Microvision Project. Next, use Creative Freedom and name the project whatever you like. After that, select the microcontroller that you have. I use the ST Microelectronics STM32F100RB microcontroller, better known as a discovery board. It'll ask you to put some initial files in the project, you can just decline that. And here you have your empty project. Next, open up a blank file and immediately save as. Name the file whatever you like, but give it a .s extension. Next, right-click the Source Group folder and click Add Files to Group. Use the File Selector and change the viewable files to the .s extension and then find your previously saved .s file and click Add. Now your file has been added to your project. And now you're ready to start. 